And there was someone laying there. I, you know, I didn't know. I thought maybe they were sleeping, maybe they were passed out on drugs, whatever. Uh, but uh, it just, it was, it was an interesting experience. You know, I don't have that good a sense of smell, and I wasn't really looking for anything like that. But, but yeah, I, I thought I'd left some food out. That's all. Uh, and I, I did miss the beginning. Did you check her or? Oh you no! Just... Oh no! No. When I when I saw the person laying there, I just backed the way um, uh, you know that's that's you, that's not something you want to do I'm, I'm kind of I'm an engineer so I'm trained in observation and emergency response and uh, in a situation like that now nah, you let the experts handle it and did you have any indication of how this person got into your home no I I mean uh, I didn't get a chance to look uh, they'll the police will be able to tell you probably well how are you feeling Oh, I'm, I mean, I'm kind of tired. I haven't had a shower yet. And I had really kind of like to, to just kind of sit down on my screen porch because it does kind of stink in the house. Um, I, I just kind of like to sit on the screen porch and relax. And, and you know, thing is I had just started setting up my video surveillance system. And last night at the police station, we checked it and there was nothing on it because I didn't have the system completely set up yet. Uh, before I leave on the next trip, <laughs> it is going to be set up. <laughs> this is a very, very, very peaceful neighborhood. Uh, I mean, this is this was a case of some people came into the neighborhood, somehow got into the house, and and something unfortunate happened. But it wasn't like they went in and partied. And I mean, there wasn't even any dirty dishes in the sink or any trash in the trash can. It was. I don't know what happened.